what impresses me the most is that our founder and CEO are investing and they understand the importance of human resources in helping the business grow. Welcome to WorkSpan TV. I'm Marcia Rhodes for World at Work. And today we're discussing career development and performance management with the HR leaders from GoDaddy, Lane Jarvis and Natalie Johnson. Lane, let's start with you. GoDaddy is known for employees who are passionate about technological innovation. How does HR respond to that? Well, HR has had to respond to that because Go, GoDaddy is growing so rapidly and human resources uh, has really had to go from zero to 60. We are evolving the human resources and our infrastructure to be able to deliver that technology to the business so that our employees can focus on the business of GoDaddy. And really what we've, um, what we've done is with our rapid growth, in order to support all of our employee population and multiple locations, locations and internationally, we've had to use technology to become more operationally efficient. And really what we, we look to do is look at what our philosophy is around how we support our employees and what differentiates us as an employer. And then we look for technology that's designed to support that philosophy. And in those cases, and there have been some where we have not found that in the marketplace, we are fortunate that we have really world-class developers at GoDaddy who have actually partnered very strongly with my organization to build those tools for us. So tell us about some of the areas you have focused your innovation on. Well, we're really looking at the human resources infrastructure and how that infrastructure is designed to support the business and our, our growing employee um, you know, population. We have um, implemented uh, GoDaddy's first human resources management system, for example, uh, currently in the process of implementing GoDaddy's first learning management system, and we're looking at integrating all of these pieces together so that all the systems can share data and information across the entire organization. I understand that you are hiring hundreds of new employees this year. Actually, Marcia, it's probably going to be over a thousand uh, employees this year. And what does GoDaddy use to attract all these new employees? Part of it is our career development and focusing on uh, providing development to our employees. We're implementing GoDaddy's first learning management system, and this is really what is going to be the, the service delivery and how we're going to push that development out and that curriculum out. In 2011, we launched GoDaddy University, and the university is actually made up of seven colleges. They're focused on business uh, education about GoDaddy products and services so that our employees understand what it is that GoDaddy does. We focus on management and leadership. We even have a college around personal development where we actually uh, provide courses to our employees on budgeting, crediting, first-time home buying, nutrition, fitness, topics such as that. One of the, the philosophies that we're actually introducing is we're redesigning uh, our employee development plans that every employee drafts uh, with their manager. We're focusing it on kind of the 7-20-10 concept and that concept is really about 70 percent of an employee's development should come from on-the-job project learning. Uh, 20 percent should come from feedback whether that's through mentors, coaches, your manager and 10 percent should be focused on you know those uh, classroom experiences that one needs to get to support their development. So that's the GoDaddy 72010 philosophy for career development. Natalie, let's turn to you. Tell us about the compensation philosophy at GoDaddy. GoDaddy's compensation philosophy is based on pay for performance. We actually really look to differentiate our top performers from our non-performers. And with our top performers, we differentiate their pay during our annual performance cycle or our annual merit increases. Our top performers historically for the last couple of years have received 8% merit increases where our non-performers have received zero. And we really look to differentiate that level of performance so employees know that they're being recognized for that added contribution. How do you use technology to support your pay for performance philosophy? Actually, what we did at GoDaddy was we took our philosophy and we sat down with our in-house, you know, best-in-class developers, and we actually went through what we would want in in that technology, and from that point, we just kind of roadmapped what the technology would look like, and our developers built it in-house, customized to our specifications, which Natalie was very intimately involved with our developers in and can probably tell more about what that technology looks like. 
Yeah, and actually each manager has a dashboard so they can see their, and they can drill down into their, all levels of their organization. They can see everybody's, you know, they can click on it, go right to the performance review if they want to review the performance review. They can look at a dashboard that will provide them with our normalized distribution, so where they're falling against our expected result. Um, as an overall organization, they can see, you know, what part in the approval process it is. So we've really tried to, tried to create a tool for managers that it's a one-stop shop. So they can log into this tool, they can view it at any time throughout the year, even after our performance planning process, and they can go in and, you know, utilize the data um, to be able to manage performance for their employees. What are some of the other non-cash rewards that GoDaddy uses? We actually use some really unique incentives to reward our employees. Within our call center, we do a money machine. So employees can go into the money machine, grab cash. However much that they grab, it's actually grossed up, so they get that as their take home. We also give away iPads, we give away um, Wii machines, gift cards, all of it is which, all of which is grossed up. So employees are able to actually get the full value of a reward. And in addition to that, we host, um, you know, an off the hook, holiday party. We did it last year in three locations, Iowa, Denver, and Arizona, in order to accommodate our different employees in different locations. And, and our um, founder gives away millions of dollars at this event. And actually this year, our CEO has announced recently that he's sending two of our top performers to the Super Bowl. And speaking of rewards, do you measure employee engagement and what are the results of the annual employee experience survey? We do um, measure and we ask our employees on an annual basis uh, to provide us with feedback and we ask them questions on a variety of different dimensions. You know, we're concerned about, you know, their leadership and their manager and um, uh, their work environment, their benefits. We consistently have over 90% participation uh, and feedback on these um, surveys and we come in at 89 plus percent in terms of uh, engaged employees. So very high levels of engagement among our employees at GoDaddy. Well, all I can say is congratulations. This is a great example of how HR as business partners has contributed to the success using technology and innovation for a company that's growing phenomenally worldwide. For World at Work, I'm Marshall Rhodes.